Florida host your house is in the house, and the holiday season, of course, is upon us. Before you guys start hosting your family, you have to get the decorations up, right? So he is going to help us prep the house for the holiday decorations. Yes. My family likes um, to stay far away from me <laughs> Thanksgiving <laughs> right. week Smart. Smart. because <laughs> I start two days before Thanksgiving decorating the nine yep. trees and playing the Christmas music like for seven, eight hours a day. That's a lot. It is. Yeah, yeah. When do you decorate? Uh, well, usually, because we're shooting this show, we start decorating right around Thanksgiving. Pretty, like, pretty yeah. early, right? Because you're early. out on the road yeah, with the holiday out, light. Yeah, I mean, we start shooting Christmas this like, light fight. Yeah, in October. Right. So so we're, we're kind of decorated in the Christmas spirit eh, a good majority of the fall. See, I'm not that crazy. No, not at all. Not at all. And I'm sure a lot of you guys do too, right? Start decorating a little bit earlier, or at least getting into the spirit. My friend Aaliyah, who I work with on our, our Moxie, uh, we are Moxie made site, she already started this past weekend oh. decorating. So I found someone crazy. Oh, there you go. Look at that. <laughs> all right, that's okay. Okay, so where do we begin, Carter? So we're going to actually start with uh, the fireplace and wood, whether it's a wood fireplace or whether it's a Stocking gas. Stocking up on the wood. Look, most people use their fireplace a handful of times out of the year. So if you're going to have your family over, it's nice, it's great to use the fireplace. But if I recommend if you have real wood, you get it into your home and stack it at least three, four, five days before Christmas so that way it dries out. Yeah, and you should buy kiln-dried wood. Yeah, yeah, if you can get that, absolutely. But what happens is wood that is wet, it gets more smoky, particles get in the air. You don't want a bunch of people over and, and having your whole room filled with smoke no, you want around the, wood the Christmas inside. time. inside, that's a great tip. But yeah. when you buy the wood to begin with, whether it's wet or not, it should be kiln-dried so a bunch of bugs don't come crawling out of the wood into your house. That, look at you, yes. Yeah. Oh, and if you have a gas one, just yeah. check it beforehand just so you know that it's going to yes. work. But of course, it sets the and mood. And get your flu cleaned, yes. And get your flu cleaned, too. Yeah, you can do all that. Look at us working Look together. This, uh, I mean, figuring this out right away, right away, right away, right away. Now this one, the next one, which oh, is the gutters. Bad. Okay, we've oh. talked about this tip before, not for the holidays. You're already shaking your head over there, but which is funny because the gutters, this is sort of fun and sort of not fun. The fun part is decorating your house with lights, right? And the yes. gutters is something we usually string our lights on because it's a nice perimeter effect exactly. around the house. And you can see, of course, the gutters, that's where the lights should go. Well, if you're up on the ladder, it's a good thing to clean the debris oh. Oh, the so gutters. Gross. So this is the not fun part. So you know, get some gloves. What you want to do is basically you can use get some garden mask. tools. You don't need a gas mask. You don't have to go that oh, far. It's going to be nasty. Critters in there. They're not, bugs. The, the leaves probably won't look mm. like this. They'll look pretty gross. And you just get in there and get a trash bag up there with you. But again, this is the. This is my show. I don't have to do. No, this. you don't have to do it at all. <laughs> I'm just saying this is that. That's a not so fun with the fun. Okay.